Hey guys and welcome to another Miniature Adventures Review. I'm your host Gary and I'm here to present another print to play game. So this is a game called Crowdfunder, the game by River Horse Games. You may know them from such games as Jim Henson's The Labyrinth, um, Jim Henson's The Dark Crystal, uh, Terminator Genesis, um, and a few other um, games that uh, they're pretty well known for. So, Crowdfunder, what is it? So, if, for those of you who don't know what crowdfunding is, basically what happens is a, a company may not want to uh, spend all the money, their money on uh, research and development of a game um, and production of a game um, and not really get any capital back. No one's really interested in the game. So, what they do is they then go to crowdfunder and what that is they put up their conception art for the game maybe some test prints the rules some videos and generate basically hype for a game what happens is people then will pledge a certain amount of money to that game so usually I think uh, some of the scales that I've looked into are two to five bucks or pounds um, will get the game in production. You won't get a copy of the game, but you, you're helping the game. Let's say 20 bucks would um, basically get you a copy of the base game. Um, 30 would get you the base game plus this uh, limited expansion or an extra f miniature or an extra set of cards depending on the product that you're, you're crowdfunding. Now they usually have a goal somewhere between say 20,000 to 200,000. I mean there are um, there are a few that are half a million for some of the really big projects. So River Horse have been known to run some crowdfunding games um, to, to generate hype and to uh, to minimize loss. And what they did was they, they've gone through the process, the, the ups and downs, the stresses of crowdfunding looked back and gone you know the whole process is kind of like a game you know we're, we're playing a game with with the uh, the pledges and trying to get it all I wonder if we could actually turn it into a game and that's what they did and crowdfunder was born this is a fantastic game as you can see over here some of the cards I've already printed onto cardstock the artwork is absolutely beautiful um, and you know here on the channel we love uh, we love good artwork on whether it be on cards or um, f the cards or, or whether the, the package and the design um, and so this is a pure print play game that's completely free just go to the site we'll, I'll put a link in the description down below and print it off and give it a go so let's take a look at what's included in the game so the overview is basically you're creating a game for a, a campaign for a project you're trying to make it as successful as possible as I say um, you you you're trying the end the end um, of the goal of the game is basically the person who successfully funded the most projects is the winner. You do that through having a, a project, which we're going to take a look. So in here we have projects. So these are your project cards. So it could be a fan film, or you're trying to crowdfund a live phone, <laughs> which is pretty cool, or a, a baseball caps or a monster bundle or even a second copy of a game you're gonna have your target audience for that which is going to be um, potato salad uh, zombicide utilities um, well, that's project sorry my apologies it seems to have misprinted so these these are some of the projects you're going to be trying to to do um, you're going to be um, the stretch goals are things like bigger and better, bigger things for free, flashing lights, new extra bits, and popular. Um, pledges, user inputs, exciting mystery, simple. So um, these add to your pledges, and the more pledges you get, the better your uh, chances are of having your project funded. Buzzes, so. 
these are buzzwords that you can attach to your project to make them seem more um, more intriguing more more uh, inviting for people to um, basically play the game we then have stuff like um, sorry we then have updates so these updates so you can update your project with different um, stats with different uh, features to again make it more appealing um, and then they basically provide all sorts of cards for you to do exactly as you would on a crowdfunding site so here's a, a great list of the projects the pledges videos you can add a video to your, your, your pledge to basically you know boost it up um, it's a very simple game to play it's very quick um, or it can be quick I've seen a few people play it and it was uh, over in, you know 20 minutes but then some that you know it's been dragged out on um, there's a great video from River Horse uh, on the Blackjack Legacy um, channel go take a look at Andy's video he plays this with them and they basically uh, run through the game mechanics and you can see a game through I'm gonna try and get one here on the channel but pretty much print and play print it off and some nice card stock uh, I got this just from my local superstore um, print it all off I would use cardstock I mean you could just print it off on paper honestly but I mean look at this artwork this artwork is fantastic I mean it's just funny and make the kids laugh I have kids uh, of all ages um, my youngest is two he probably won't play it but the 11 year old all the way up to the 17 year old would probably uh, I'm more certain would definitely play this I'm hoping we can get you uh, guys to watch us play it. So here's a couple of updates. Market research. Choose a player and either pledge, video buzz, add-on, or stretch goal. They must give you a card of that type and draw a card. Or zombie apocalypse. Choose two audience cards from the center of the table and remove them from the round. A player without an audience card cannot be funded. So you gotta have an audience card to fund and you got all these cards in your hand to play. Market research. Choose a player either and the same keywords again they must give you a card of that type and draw a card if they cannot they show you their hand and you draw a card from their draw part that's quite sneaky so you got to kind of keep all your cards close to your chest and, and you're all trying to vie for an audience to bank to bank basically your game um, the instructions are pretty much just um, a few pages I mean Two pages I believe for the actual uh, rules and then a set of optional rules as well um, to, to uh, make longer games shorter games and to help you plan ahead please please go check this game out as a print to play game that you literally just need a printer or you know just I did print off the work um grab it and just basically run with it and, and play it. I'm hoping River Horse adds a, maybe a couple of more expansions to this. I think there's all sorts they can definitely do with this game. Um, and it definitely takes you on a roller coaster through uh, the uh, process of crowdfunding. So that's all we have time for today, guys. Um, please. Um, pop over to River Horse's uh, site, grab a copy of the game, uh, check out the other games they've got. Let's say they've got Terminator Genesis, they've got Jim Henson's The Labyrinth, Jim Henson's The Dark Crystal, and the models for those games are absolutely beautiful. Um, if you have any youngsters who you want to get into kind of like Dungeon Dragon type role playing, they have a fantastic game based on the My Little Pony franchise, um, and it's great for boys and girls of you know young and old ages. I mean, I personally may try and get a, a copy and play with some uh, grown ups just to kind of you know have a bit of fun. So they have that on there. Um, check that out please if you like this video um 
please consider subscribing, like the video, tap the bell notification uh, so you can get updated on new content as and when it comes out. And if you feel that you want to help support this channel, um, then please head on over to Patreon. We have a Patreon page there. It basically helps to support the hobby and make the hobby self-contained um, the way from the rest of uh, my, my finances. <laughs> so... Have a great day, and I'll see you all down on the board. All right, bye.